past seven um, welcome to a day in my life I'm just out for my little morning walk my daily non-negotiable I put this on my story a few times whoa no stop yeah I put this on my story a few times just get my daily walk in 3,000 steps 4,000 steps just to start the morning off the right way sets me up for the rest of the day but yeah I'm gonna crack on with this walk and then I'll uh, get home and I'll see you when I get back to my house Right, what's going on? I have uh, came back from my morning walk. I had one of my morning coffees whilst watching the Kamaru Usman versus Leon Edwards scrap highlights. Scrap highlights? Fight highlights. But uh, that was a class fight, actually. I watched that and I was like, shit, Leon Edwards is class. Guest for the podcast, 100%. And Usman. I can't, do you know what? I can't wait to start talking to UFC fighters on the podcast. I think it's going to be... It's going to be mad. And I can't wait for Club Iron to get to that level where we can just go to UFC events and, and speak to the fighters and do podcasts of them. Podcasts of Conor McGregor, that would be huge. Obviously, that's a few years in the future, but yeah, game's a game, innit? <laughs> anyway, i got to go to Kamal then now. I need to drop some stuff off from my old workplace. I need to take it back because it's their property. Um, so I'll probably pick you up when I get... Oh, what the... Oh, yeah. Yeah, so i got to go to Kamal then and drop some stuff off from my old workplace. So um, I'll probably pick you up when I get back from that. I've got... <clears throat> I got some work to do as well, and I need to have my cream of rice, and then I'm going to go train, and then I've got a call, and well, me and Alex have got a call with Fortis, who are a company we met on the weekend in the Performex. They like help you level up in your business and whatnot. We got a call with them, and then uh, and then I got BJ tonight to my last training session before my first fight in three years. Wow. Anyway, I'm going to get back. I'm going to get to Kamala now and then I'll uh, I'll see you on the way back. I'll, well, I'll, I'll see you actually when I'm back. Right, what's going on? I'm back from Kamala now. Yeah, this is on. I'm back from Kamala. Um, nice little spin down there. I'm just about sitting at my desk having my second coffee. I'm sat going to be sat down at my desk cracking over some work and then I'm going to I'm going to eat my pre-workout meal. Pull on the cards today. Juicy fucking pull session. Three, no, how many days out am I? Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Three days out from my fight. Um, so, so this is actually my last weight session before my fight, so I'm quite excited about that. I'm, I'm quite excited to fight on the weekend. But um, yeah, I'm just sitting down, just trying to plan some some solo podcast episodes. And um, we got one of the cards here. What childhood obesity has taught me, obviously. For those of you who don't know, I was a pretty chunky boy. Um, I was a pretty chunky boy when I was younger. Actually, there's a photo in my room with me when I was younger, and you can see how chunky I was. Look at that. Got a that rubber ring. But yeah, just do, doing some pl- doing some work, doing some planning, getting some content planned out, and then I'm gonna eat my pre-workout, edit some reels that I've got for some of our clients, and then I will be and then I'll be on my way to the gym and I'm gonna train. So yeah, I'll catch you when I'm going to eat my pre-workout meal. Right, what's going on? Got my pre-workout meal here. 60 grams cream of rice, 45 grams of whey, frozen blueberries, solid cup of tea, and I got my my mineral water by there, which I'll, I'll get down after this. But yeah, I'm gonna hop onto a call now with Alex. We've got a bit of a meeting to discuss business, and then, um, 
and then I'll pick you up after that, walk you through what I'm going to do for the rest of the day, and we'll take it from there. It's very abstract. It's trying to describe things in a way that you can change. So, yeah, I can do anything. We can make arrows explode when they hit the ground and stuff. The right time. Oh, well, nice. Gym fit, look at that. Ultraflex rag top. Right, cold shower done. About to head off to the gym. Why am I doing 360s in my room? Head off to the gym, got the Ultraflex rag top on. I feel like I shouldn't, I feel like I should just train in the Ultraflex rag top and put a vest in my bag. I don't know. I don't know. What do you think? Oh, yeah. Bang. Ultraflex rag top. Gymshack joggers, excuse the mess. I have a vest underneath. I don't know, I feel like this is too. I don't know, I feel like this is too much. I can't put a vest underneath. Maybe a stringer. I don't know what I'll look now. Right. I'll see you at the gym. I just had a nice cold shower, moisturized. Look good, feel good, play good. Um, catch you at the gym. Pull today, gonna fucking get a massive juicy pump. I shall see you there. Right, cancel that. Ultraflex rag top. Ultraflex right top, black Gymshark vest, black Gymshark joggers. Let's get to the gym. I'm, gonna t I'm actually going to take some pre today as well, like a BJJ later, so catch you for that. I'm going to get to the gym. I'll see you when I fucking get there. Woo! Don't know why I did that. That was a bit fucking gay. Anyway. Bang! Right. See you when we're at the gym. Right, I am outside the Welsh maker that is PB Fitness Academy. I keep showing you this as if you're going to see it. But yeah, I'm going to get in there now, get, get pulled on. I, got, I need to do this quite quickly today because I've got a meeting at 3.30 and it takes about, fucking the light in here, it takes about 40 minutes to get home, so I need to be quite quick. It's currently quarter to one. I'm going to get in training. I'm going to try and do it in about 70 minutes. Got the Ultraflex rag top on. Bang! These rag tops are so comfy. And a nice little vest underneath. But I'll see you inside. Be a quick little montage, probably, I'd imagine. And then I'll pick you back up then and speak to you. Probably when I'm home and I'm going to have my post workout meal. So enjoy the training footage and I shall see you shortly.
Right, gym session done, back in the house. 60 grams away here post-workout and I got a jam bagel I need to eat. But I'm currently gonna go into a meeting with Fortis, company we met in Performex. So um, yeah, I got a meeting with them, me and Alex. I'll hit you back up, or pick you back up after the meeting, tell you how I went, and then I'll have the second half of my post-workout meal. See you then. What is going on? Part two of my post-workout meal. Got a bagel. With 15 grams of jam, good old cup of tea. I'm gonna smash this, uh, I'm gonna get this smashed down, and then uh, I'm gonna get back upstairs, do some work, and I'm gonna have chicken and rice at 5 o'clock before BJJ, and then BJJ 6 o'clock, well, 6.30 till probably 8.30, BJJ 6.30 until 8.30, probably 9, and then I'll get home and have my last meal, and then it'll be time for bed. But um, anyway, I'm gonna crack on with this, and then I'm gonna get upstairs and do some work. I will see you probably when I have my next meal. Also, my work earlier was fucking sick. Took some pre as well, that went, that went down well. Fucking sick. Anyway, I'll, um, I'm gonna leave you go. I'll see you back when I'm about to have my next meal. This will be my last meal before BJJ, and then I got BJJ 6.30. My last session before my fight as well. So yeah, maybe get some of that in as well. Alex behind the camera should be. But yeah, anyway, I'll catch you. Uh, I'm gonna do this and then I got some more work through before I go to BJJ, and then I'll be training and then coming home, get my steps in, finish my last meal, and that'll be my day round it off. Just an average day, really. But uh, yeah, I'll catch you when I'm on the way to BJJ after I've eaten this, I think. Times now, it's now 10 past six. I need to get ready and change for BJJ and then I need to leave. I will not be filming any of BJJ, um, simply for the fact of, because my goal there, it's gonna be in the zone, uh, in the zone training. And I'm just gonna get, just get shit done, really. Um, I'll catch up with you when I am finished. Apologies for the lack of footage from BJJ, but I never really record those sessions because I'm always rolling and, and training, so it's quite serious. But um, yeah, I'll see you when I'm probably smashed from BJJ. Right, I shall catch you tonight. It'll probably be about nine o'clock, maybe. I'll have a meal, get my steps in, and then yeah, I'll see you then. Oh, what's going on, everyone? 21 minutes past nine. Just got back from BJJ. Awesome last session. I'm absolutely ruined. Yeah, I need to finish my steps off as well. I got air fried potatoes and beef for dinner. And I need to finish my steps off. I need about 3k. Let me have a look. Oh. Yeah, 6,429 I've done. So yeah, I need to get a cheeky little 3k in. I'm gonna do that whilst my food's cooking. I'm gonna eat my food and then it'll be it'll be bedtime. Up to do it again in the morning. This has been this has been a decent video to be honest with you. I enjoy making these type of videos, little, little vlogs, day in the life vlogs. Um comment down below if you wanna see more vlogs, more daily stuff. Because I feel like I feel like people are nosy and they wanna see what goes on in our lives, especially because sometimes our lives are quite cool. Most of the time they're shit. Most of the time they're shit and you shouldn't watch them. You should not watch this video. But if you are, I appreciate it. If you're new here, don't forget to fucking subscribe. Um, if you want shit content, if you want world-class content, subscribe. And if you're new, I'd appreciate it if you consider subscribing. Um, but anyway, I'm going to crack on and get my steps in. 
I'm not going to take you with me because my camera is fucked. And not I say fucked, it's on like 3%. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get my steps in. I'll pick you up when I have my last meal. And uh, I'll have a little chat. And then um, and then I'll be my day nice and wrapped up. Ready for bed, shower, go to bed, wake up, do it all again in the morning. Same thing, crack on. Um, I was actually sending... I had a bit of a nightmare as well because I was sending stuff on my laptop to, to one of the clients and it died when it was transferring over so it sort of failed to transfer which is not not ideal but I'm rambling on you like fuck because I just feel drowsy after BJJ but game's a game I need to get on with it get my steps in Oh, right, last meal about to go down. Really exciting meal. <laughs> 200 grams of potatoes, 150 gram of beef mince, and a handful of spinach, or a couple of handfuls. This is my, this is my last meal of the day. It is currently 20 past 10. I should have had this a bit earlier, but obviously get back from BJJ and actually cooking the meal to it's taking a bit longer. If you haven't hated every second of this video, then I suggest that you subscribe down below, turn on the notification bell. I'm gonna eat this, then I'm gonna shower, and then I'm gonna get into bed, ready to do it all again tomorrow. Tomorrow's gonna be a full day of editing, so I thought I'd film it for you today, because I'm gonna have a rest day tomorrow, and I got a full day of editing, so it's not really gonna be that fun. Well, this, is, this hasn't been bundles of fun, but you know, it's just a realistic day. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna smash this down here. Like, comment, and please subscribe if you didn't hate every second of this video. And I'll catch you in the next video.